we can now add to our library of functions by adding two basic rational functions. First off, we have the reciprocal function, and this is one that we've already seen in our library of functions. And so the domain will consist of anything that's not allowing the denominator to be zero, so x can't be zero. Then you also see from the graph that y can't be zero. So we'll see the x-axis is excluded for that reason in the graph. And all of the x values all just become the reciprocal whenever we plug it in. So the output will be the reciprocal. So negative 2 becomes negative 1 half. 1 half becomes 2. So we see two branches of this curve. Another function that we can add to our library of parent functions is f of x equals 1 over x squared. So this is not the reciprocal function, but we still cannot have x be 0. And this time, what we see is both branches lie above the x-axis, and so the range is just 0 to infinity. We still see the break in the domain of a, the exclusion of the y-axis, so x can't be 0. And we have guide points that flip and then square the number. To determine, to determine the output. So let's take a look at an example. Whenever we think about this function, we know that this will be a shift left three units and then down two. So the domain, instead of just excluding zero, will shift that to the left and x can't be negative three. Of course, we can just set the denominator equal to zero and see that. So the domain will be negative infinity to negative 3 union negative 3 to infinity. Now let's put some guidelines on this graph. We've shifted everything left 3 units, so instead of excluding the y-axis, we can exclude x equals negative 3. And since we were, in the parent function, y equals x squared, above the x-axis. We're now moving that down two units, so let's move that down two units. We don't have any scaling going on, so the point that was negative 2, 1 fourth, will move to the left 3, 1, 2, 3 and down to 1, 2. The point that was negative 1, 1 will move left 3 units and down 2. So we'll be now at negative 4, negative 1. And what was negative 1 half, 4, We'll move left 3 and down 2. So we'll be at negative 3 and a half, comma 2. There's really, with this, just symmetry about this vertical line. And so this was just a shift left three units and then down two units of our parent function.